I mean, it was nine to nothing. Nine nothing. You, I, you can't say, oh, it's a, it's a mega MAGA court. Mm-hmm. You, you, can't, you can't begin to say that. Unanimous. This was actually too much, even for the progressives on the court. They, you can't. You talk about democracy. There's nothing less democratic than taking Donald Trump off the ballot. None of the written opinions mentioned, by the way, that I, as far as I saw, the most glaring reason not to take Donald Trump off the ballot, and that is that he hasn't been charged <laughs> or convicted. Of insurrection! A point we've been making for years. I, there's been no charge, let alone a conviction. You can't remove him based on an allegation. I don't care if it's Congress or if it's uh, the state or whomever does it. You can't remove a person based on an allegation. Yeah. It's just... it's. It's inconceivable to and, me. Yeah, and I wasn't clear. This was the case, if you uh, don't recall. Uh, Colorado, Colorado being uh, taking uh, Donald Trump off the ballot. So he appears on the ballot in Colorado today. And, I and guess, Maine and yeah, wherever Yeah, and so else. you've got your precedent now, right? Yeah. So here's your here's your case law that the left loves, loves so much. Nine nothing. Here it is. Keep him on every ballot. Yeah. Yep. I, can't I mean, they were pretty clear about that. How, how did we even get that I, far? I don't know. I don't know. It's it's incredible that it got to that ludicrous place to begin with. But here's the Colorado uh, Secretary of State right. on the Supreme Court ruling. I'm sure they're pleased. My larger reaction is disappointment. I is do it? believe that states really should be able under our Constitution to mm-hmm. bar oath-breaking insurrectionists. <laughs> and ultimately, this decision leads <sighs> open or leaves open the door for Congress to, Pause it for a to pass authorizing Whether legis- or not a state can or can't remove an insurrectionist, first, they have to be one! They have to be an insurrectionist. Then... Maybe. Oh, although, according to the U.S. Supreme Court, no, you can't. Mm-hmm. Sorry, that's got to be Congress. Congress can do that. The states can't do that. The U.S. Congress can do it, but not you. Okay, but he's not an insurrectionist. <laughs> I don't. I don't know where they're getting this. I, how is that lost on anybody? I don't understand it. He's been not even charged with being an insurrectionist. <laughs> it's truly oh it's it's agonizing it sure is all right let her finish rising <laughs> legislation what a dummy. Uh, but we know that congress is a wow. nearly non-functioning body <laughs> so ultimately it will be up to the american voters to save our democracy in november that's all, <laughs> and that's honestly isn't that all we're asking yeah that's literally yeah. that's all we've been saying is right you love democracy so much let it, it let it work do you just not trust the people is that is that what the problem is here my gosh these people are something else man oh it's just so so it, it is congress's purview yeah uh, according to the supreme court in the right, ruling right and even if he were an insurrectionist it's congress's purview correct and so of course the left the liberals in congress are already making plans you got to see jamie raskin here yesterday all right i am working with a number of my colleagues including uh, Debbie Wasserman Schultz and Eric Swalwell oh, to Swalwell. revive legislation that we had to set up a process uh-huh. by which we could determine that someone uh, who committed insurrection <laughs> is disqualified by Section 3 of the 14th Amendment. And the House of Representatives mm-hmm. already impeached Donald Trump for participating in insurrection uh, by inciting it. So the mm-hmm. House has already pronounced upon that. Mm. So that's what they're trying to yeah. They're trying mm-hmm. to claim that the house pronounced on it uh, the, the sorry the old house yeah and this one and i'm sorry that's not a court of law he's been convicted of nothing yep. nor has he been charged in a court of law with insurrection it's just wow. stunning that that the party that continues to scream democracy 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 is trying to remove it <laughs>